Yeah, so I'm Mark McCree, Head of Libraries. We do an awful lot within the library service to support vulnerable people and people who are homeless. I mean, first and foremost, the libraries are a warm and welcoming space for everyone to spend time. Um, so we get an awful lot of people who just come in to pass, pass the time of day. You know, you don't need to be a member of the library as such to use it, to come in and sit down, to read the paper. In terms of kind of joining the library, which you need to do to kind of borrow books, we kind of waive identification checks for people who are homeless of no fixed abode. We often maybe we'll get a letter of kind of recommendation or something from Street Life or another um, organisation, but ultimately we don't need to do a full ID check. So a lot of, of people in more vulnerable positions use us for digital access, you know, um, they do borrow books, they often sit, sit in, in the library itself reading the, reading the books. Uh, we support people with kind of discretionary loans and signposting to other key agencies. We've had housing options drop in sessions within the libraries themselves because uh, a lot of people who are vulnerable and homeless use, use the libraries on a day to day basis. So, so it makes that really a sensible interaction. But I think one of the main reasons people use this is because we're, we're kind of not an interventive, that's a word, uh, service really. We don't put any demands on them. So they, so anyone coming in can just use the service as and how they want. And if they need us to give us give them a hand, getting onto a computer or getting in touch with people, we can we can do that and we do. Um, we have volunteers who come in and help, especially around digital access, um, very regularly. You know, there is no financial reason why someone can't access the library and all aspects of the library. So I think it's that equality of provision as well. So when they come in the door, they're just, you know, they're just another punter alongside absolutely everybody else. So I think that kind of respect, that kind of warm, welcoming nature of, of the staff, you know, and the, and the fact that they can use the service in the same way as everybody else. So yeah, there's an awful lot going on.